Restoration of the halls is part of efforts to renovate the entire museum that houses the mummy of the 19-year-old boy King. The project aims at carrying out architectural restoration work. This has created employment and offered training to local staff made up of university students and museum staff. The museum currently holds approximately 120,000 items. It was founded in 1895 and opened in 1902 by the last ruler of Egypt and Sudan under Ottoman rule Abbas Halme. The museum has faced obstacles. When the budget was placed for its creation at the Egyptian cabinet at the time, it was faced with objections and the approval of its budget was postponed once and twice. So Hedivi Abbas Helmi asked for the cabinet to appear and that happened and they approved the 250,000 Egyptian pounds to create this museum. The overhaul will be funded partly by international donors. The European Union will contribute uh, next year to the restoration of the east wing of the Tutankhamun Gallery right here at the Museum of Antiquities. With a contribution of 92,500 euros and working with uh, Munir Niamatala and his uh, expert team, we are very much looking forward to making our contribution uh, to the restoration and revival of uh, this museum. The renovation project will also make the museum environmentally friendly by 2016. Robert Soy, CCTV.